know what? Let me say something. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, brother. I would not lie to you. Mm-hmm. And I tell it to my mother-in-law. She's a Jehovah's Witness. Okay, go ahead. And I tell it to everybody. Mm-hmm. I say when you actually truly study the Word of God. Okay. And you look into it. Mm-hmm. I say, dude, he has to be talking about the nation. He got to be talking about black people. That's right. It, it reflects nothing but That's... black people. Everything you read in the Bible, it reflects nothing but black folk. Exactly. It don't reflect no other nation but black people. Exactly, brother. Right. The world, See, bro, that's the spirit. Like, dude, I'm, that, that's, am I lying? Uh-uh. Bro, it's like every time, and even because I was a seven-day Adventist, mm-hmm. I was all that, and I was in the Word, faithful, moving, and all that stuff. But as I go on through life, mm-hmm. Everything reflects when you look at the Bible. It reflects only the black mm-hmm. people, bro. Yeah. It reflects us, too. right? And, and that's the, that's the thing. And I, and I ask her that because you know she big on the Jehovah Witness thing, and it's mm-hmm. like, you know what I'm saying? I told you I was Seventh Day Adventist, mm-hmm. but dude, it's like for some apparent reason, I would never sit put in one faith in one religion. You understand what I'm saying? Because I was a seeker. You understand what I'm saying? I'm always going around because you ain't gonna tell me. That what you know is the truth and everybody else is a lie. Right, right. You see what I'm saying? Huh. And as I begin to reflect more and read, read more and more, I begin to say, hold up, man, this um uh, you you understand what I'm saying? But recently, I'm talking about recently, mm-hmm. as a progression of what's going on in the world today, I promise you, dude, I said, uh, there has to be black people have to be the they right have to be the They have to be, bro. It's, it's impossible to think otherwise. I don't know about y'all, mm-hmm. but it's impossible to think otherwise, dog, because everything in the Bible reflects what we're going through right now, today. From the south, you talk is cheap like a Roman noodle. All you talk about is what about the white man? I think you like a Roman noodle. How you pro black but love some white girls? Don't you know what they did to us? They gave us perms, made you hate yourself, made you pro abortion, made you feminist. Nah, 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 boo boo. Don't let these people fool you. Called out their Ben Boozu. Don't you know that you Hebrew? Prom Yashar Allah. I'm glad that you said that. Let me get Deuteronomy uh, 28 and um, Signing Wonders. Oh, 46. And they shall be a sign. Yeah, what's up, 45? The reason, I'm, I'm glad that you mentioned what you mentioned, brother, because it's, there's a reason why. It's actually in the Bible, what you're saying. The reason, like, you could, could relate to what's going on in, in, in Jehovah's Witness, you could relate to, um, like, the fact that you said um, we are black. You know what I'm saying? The whole thing that's happening is, is happening to black folks. There's a reason why you're saying all that, because the most I put in the scriptures for us as a sign. Read that record, Bible, because y'all. Come Deuteronomy 28, verse 45. Mm-hmm. Moreover, all these curses shall come upon you, mm-hmm. come upon thee, uh-huh. and pursue thee. And pursue. These are curses we're talking about. Read. Moreover, all these curses shall come upon thee, and pursue thee, and uh-huh. overtake thee, take thee till thou be destroyed. Uh-huh. Because thou hearkenest not unto the, vo- unto the voice of the Lord thy God. Mm-hmm. 46. To keep his commandments and his statutes, uh-huh. which he commanded thee. Right, 46, bro. But see, here's a question. Oh. And they, I'm gonna show you. Hold on. and they shall be upon thee. These are curses. It's gonna be upon you for really? a sign. For what? For a sign. For a sign. And a wonder. And a and wonder. wonder. That's how you. That's how you identify yourself. See, this is what I'm saying. Those mm. are good how do you identify? Because we've been taught so many things for so many years. Twenty and one. So in the back of our subconscious minds, mm-hmm. we don't see the Jehovah, the God that it says in the scriptures. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna show you. You they mm-hmm. right? We don't see him. We see the other. The, you do. You understand what I'm saying? So how do we connect mm-hmm. with who he oh, yeah. is to be delivered from that? That's what I'm asking. Come. How do we connect? Go ahead. I'm gonna show you why, brother. Read. And it's like on the past. And thou shalt hearken diligently. It says it's going to come to pass if you were to listen ke- um, diligently, carefully. Uh huh. Unto the voice of the Lord thy God. Unto the voice, your God. Remember, it says thy God, your God. Uh huh. Come. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, Humphrey. <laughs> you jumping now? No, no, I'm not jumping, but say, think about what we was taught. Come, come. All our lives. Come on. You understand what I'm coming from? Come. Go ahead. No, you can get what you're getting. Yeah. And it shall come to pass, if thou shalt hearken diligently uh-huh. unto the voice of the Lord thy God, Read. to observe to and to do all his commandments. To commandments. See, it goes back to the commandments. Read. 
which I command thee this day, uh -huh. that the Lord thy God will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. Let's say the most I will set you high above all nations of the earth. Let me ask you, do you think we're high above all nations of the earth right now? The so-called black people? No. Oh, praise it. Exactly. Why? Because why? Because we refuse to keep the laws of, the, um, God, laws of God. Read. Let me get to the curse. 15. John 15. 15. Mm -hmm. But it shall come to pass, if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God uh -huh. to observe, uh -huh. to do all his commandments. Again, we repeat itself to do the commandments. Of course, we didn't, re we didn't do the commandments because guess what? We at the bottom right now, as you say, right? Read. And his statutes which I command thee this day. Uh-huh. That all these curses all shall these, come upon thee. All these curses shall come upon thee. Read, read the brother curses. Curse shall thou be in the city. Curses shall be in the city. If you look around, brother, where you dwelling right now? We in the project. You looking at our brothers and sisters. We in the project. We in the hood. We getting killed down the streets. Right? These are curse according to the Bible. This is happening to so-called black, Native American, Hispanic men. It's not happening to the other nations. It's happening to us. Right? Read. And curse shall thou, shall thou be in the field. Curse shall thou, shall thou be in the field. Think about it, brother. Where the field at? Who this happen to? Us. These are the curses, brother. It's in the Bible. Right? You're not going to hear this from the seven Jehovah Witness Church. They're not going to tell you all this truth right here. Right? This is this, this what happened. Keep reading. And... I'm sorry. Curses shall, thou, curses shall be thy basket and thy store. Anything that you need to eat, brother. These are curses. Certain stuff that you eat is abomination according to the most side. Read. Cursed shall be the fruit of thy body mm -hmm. and the fruit of thy land. Uh -huh. And the, inc the increase of thy kind. Get 37. 37. Yeah, I'm jump to another curse. You got to understand because you got because you relate to these curses, brother. They actually, this is happening to us. Read. And thou shalt become an astonishment. A proverb. You know that? It said we're going to become an astonishment, brother. You understand that? An astonishment. Like we're going to be a shock to these other people. No, Read. You know what? You know what? Just quote me. He said you're going to be a proverb. Yeah. Certain names we've been called. Uh huh. The other day. Yeah. Tell her my wife. Mm. Because we're going through hell right now. <laughs> and I swear I told her. I say that. I say it feel like I'm becoming a proverb. Mm -hmm. Proverbs that you know what I'm saying that you, you know you read in the scriptures you hear the proverbs oh, I swear it just eluded my mind just right. now and it's crazy that you just said that it's crazy that you just said that come on, come on. but you know, do you understand what it means by uh, trust me I just, listen I'm gonna tell you yeah. I'm gonna tell you bro like I lived a, uh, 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 a different kind of lifestyle been to prison and all that stuff so come on, come on. in that kind of time mm -hmm. what I used to do is I used to get in the word and study the word of God I used to, I used to read it too. All the time, you see what I'm saying? So I have a clear understanding. Mm -hmm. I, in prison, I, you got the Hebrew Israelites, right? Con, con, agree. You see what I'm saying? So I, I ran into all kind of a, all kind of faith, right? In there, you know what I mean? So trust me, brother. I, I understand exactly what con. you're talking about. Con, con. I understand exactly what you're talking about. Con, this is for when you when you were like, how can we relate God to you know to us? Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You heard that in a book all my like let me I'm glad you said that. Let me get Joshua one and eight. Right. It says that in the books. Everything is in that book. It's like you stick to this book, brother. Listen, I'm waiting on food over here, right? What you gonna eat, brother? Some roti. Some what? Some roti, some chicken roti. Uh good. You you gonna eat that grill, right? No, no grill. How much is grill? How much is uh in the local shop? Alright, oh praises. Get the brother here. One eight. Okay. Joshua chapter one verse eight. Read. This book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth. You heard that? It says the book of the Most High should not depart out of your mouth, brother. Hey, hold up. See, I gotta go. Uh -huh. How do I link up with y'all, man? Give the brother fly by with y'all. I gotta fly. How do I link up with y'all, man? You get a number. Get his number. What's your name again? Humphrey. Brother. Whip. I got you, Humphrey. Give him. A, you got a flyer. Anybody got a fly? Yeah, yeah. I need what he just did. Yeah, yeah. Listen, listen, I need that. Humphrey. I need that. Yeah. Well, that's why we're here for it, brother. Yeah, go ahead. Do your thing, brother. I'm going to go right now, bro. Pa 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 wale, no? No, get this scripture, Go ahead. Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 68. 
And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. You, you heard that, Humphrey? It says, the most I shall bring you into Egypt again with ships. The word Egypt is synonymous for slavery. You know that? Read that again for the brother. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. You heard that? It says, the most I gonna bring you into Egypt again with ships. The first time, how, how, you see what I'm saying? That's slavery. It says he's going into slavery again with ships. How do we get to Haiti? scripture when he says that you'll be enslaved for how many years but hold on hold on hold on don't jump now no, I ain't jumping. How, how, how do we no i heard what you're saying how do we get to haiti see this is in the bible Trans, you, you ever heard of transatlantic slavery transatlantic slavery you ever heard of that that's all that's the history they give us how we got to america how we got to haiti how they went how they went to africa right and snatch us out of africa bring us down here as slavery you ever heard of that you never heard of black folk and uh, white folks went down to Africa and no, snatched no, us no, up? No, 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 I know that's what you're saying. Like the, the actual name is transatlantic slavery. Yeah, that's, 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 that's in history. If you Google it, you see it. It shows you how, how the black man got to America, how we got to Haiti, how we got to all the parts of the earth. Because that's that's actually in the Bible. That's recorded in the Bible. It shows that how we got to Haiti, how we got to America. Read that again, Bible Shaw. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. With what? With ships. How do we get to Haiti? With ships. How do we get to America? With ships. You heard that, it, Humphrey? Humphrey, it's in the Bible. <laughs> Read. Deuteronomy chapter twenty-eight, verse sixty-eight. We got to give you a flyer though. It's in the flyer too. Twenty and sixty-eight. Hey, one. He got one, Cap. Yeah, we got one. Hey man, but y'all need to call me, bro. Come. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, you know. Hey, I'm gonna see you to Shabbat. I'm gonna see you next Saturday, brother. You know what you are. I, 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 you know what you are. Oh, praise to the Most High. You know what you are. You gonna see me? We're the servant of the Most High, brother. Oh, praise. Oh, praise. Bum bum. I'll be wrong if I don't give you the scripture before you go. First Corinthians chapter three, verse sixteen. Uh huh. Know ye not that ye are the temple of God? He said, Know that you are the temple of God. Your body is the temple of God. Read. And that the Spirit of God dwelleth in you? He said, The Spirit of God dwelleth in you. Read. If any man defile the temple of God, <laughs> if any man defile the gotta, temple of God, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta touch that out, brother. He <laughs> said, you, you gotta let it go. I see what you're saying. Yeah, you gotta remove it, brother, because the most high, there's a reason why you came up here, brother. Remember, our salvation is near than we believe. At any given moment, uh, this could happen. You could hear the bang, uh, and it's over with. You know what I'm saying? That's why we're here. You gotta, you gotta throw that out. Uh, you gotta throw that away. You know what I'm saying? Even though it's. <laughs> there you go. Done. Never again. Yeah.